Hey cellos, this is a quick how to play it video for song number 113, The Mountain Deer Chase. That's your Essential Elements book two song for this week. So the big deal about this one is remembering to play B flat and E flat. I know that every B and E are flat because of the key signature. This first one is for B flat, the second one is for E flat. So we've got B flats here both on the A string, um, but also later on on the G string. And we also have E flats on the D string. That means we're gonna to have to use a backwards extension on the A string for B flat and also on the D string for E flat. So that means I have this kind of hand shape where I've tipped my first finger back onto its side and I have a big stretch to my second finger. Also, don't play any third fingers in this song because on the A string we've got C natural, you know, we don't even play any Cs. Um, on the D string we have F natural and on the G string our B flat is second finger, not third finger. Um, remember in places like the very first measure where you're going from first finger to fourth finger, I know they're on separate strings, but you don't have to hold that backwards extended stretch. You can let that first finger release when you go for your fourth finger so that you don't stress out your hand. So after I play my B flat, I'm just gonna let it release. I'm not gonna let it come all the way up by my second finger and squash together but I'm gonna pick it up off the string so I have an easier time reaching my G. So anytime you have to go from a fourth finger or you have to go back to that flat, just keep it stretched out, but don't have to hold it down in place. All right, I'm gonna play the whole song for you so you hear how it sounds. Ready, set, go. <laughs> Watch out for those backwards extensions and have fun practicing.